second time, the battle is on, and Pathé Gazette is privileged to present exclusive pictures inside Broadcasting House with spelling master Tom Woodroffe at the table on the right. The British spellers you will see at the microphone are first actress Fabia Drake, second secretary Margaret Baines, and third schoolboy J.E. Killick. Fabia Drake begins the words forthright. Forthright. F-O-R-T-H-R-I-G-H-T. Well, that's a very good start, Miss Drake. Thank you. And now, across to America, Miss Sarah Hayden. Uh, get ready. Uh, the word is verdancy. Verdancy, Miss Hayden. Greenness. Verdancy. D-U-R-D-A-N-C-Y. Verdancy. Oh, that's too bad, Miss Hayden. <laughs> that's too bad. That is first uh, casualty for the American team. And the next speller, Miss Margaret Baines, this, the British secretary. Miss Baines, it's still verdancy. Verdancy, Miss Baines. V-E-R-D-A-N-C-Y, verdancy. Thank you very much, Miss Baines. Now, uh, Mr. McCluskey, um, the word is fawns. Horns, Mr. McCluskey, the noun meaning rural deities represented as men with horns and the tails of goats. Now, well, the new one to me, P-H-A-W-N-S. <laughs> I'm sorry, but the spellometer doesn't agree with that spelling, and it goes back across the Atlantic to uh, Mr. Killick. I don't believe in them, but F-A-U-N-S, fawns. <laughs> that was correct, Mr. Killick. And so the final score is Great Britain, 37, and... The USA, 27.